My name is Sarah Wheat and I am the Engagement Officer for the Diocese of St Asif. So today I've been working with volunteers to make uh, 90 pack lunches that we are going to take out to two different play providers to allow children to have access to food during the school holidays. The church wanted to do something to help children in, in their community and that's why we use the church to make the food and we take it out to where the children are via play. The church became involved once we became aware of this issue we started to find out that there wasn't anywhere for children to go during the school holidays and it just made us think what does happen to these children that would normally receive two meals a day during term time? What happens uh, in the school holidays? And we found out there wasn't anything available at the time. Hi, my name's Holly and I'm volunteering with the Holiday Hunger Scheme. I've been making sandwiches, cutting and buttering bread. We've made ham, chicken, tuna sandwiches with salad and then packing them up to go to the children. As a teacher, I think I know the impact that it can have on children if they haven't got enough food inside them, if they're hungry, they can't concentrate. It's not fair and I think I'm very passionate about children and them getting the best opportunities. So I think it's great. Hi, my name's Linda Platt known as Bronson and I'm the playground manager here at The Venture. Our aims are to integrate children, the social aspect of, of coming to the adventure playground and just sort of getting to know your neighbour, making friends. We believe it's quite important for their well-being and because it's all centred around play, it just enlightens a sense of creativity with young people, building dens, doing some art and crafts, performing and also the physical side which is um, which is very important for for children nowadays we're living in difficult times right now without those food donations children would, would be hungry because we can clearly see there's there's a need for that there's there's a positive impact that comes when we are, are feeding the children during the holidays i'm leon williams i'm a play worker at the, here at the venture Having the food here is a massive impact really because obviously the children are going to school, they're getting their meals at school, but during holidays um, there's families out there that do struggle with having to feed their children, even if it's only two meals a day it's hard for some of the families around the area. So having the food here is a massive, massive thing for children that come down because they know if they're going to come here they are going to be fed. My name's Rhiannon Jones, I'm a play worker and lead youth worker here at The Venture. So typically we work with children from 5 to 16 but it can be up to 24 with youth club but we also work really well with the community. I know if The Venture wasn't here a lot of families and young people would be struggling. When we first started this project it was really about building relationships because the play providers weren't particularly aware of the church and, and our wanting to work with them. So to start off with we needed to build those relationships with them and with the community to say we care about you, we care about your children and we know this is an issue and we think we have a way that we could work together to find a solution. Now those relationships are really good and they know they can come to us for support and we know that we can deliver projects through them and work together to find a solution to holiday hunger that fits with that community.